Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to our video. In today's video, we are checking out the brand new Driving Empire update. In this update, we have three new cars, new loading screen, Winterfest countdown, lighting improvements, performance optimizations, and some bug fixes. So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, so I'm at the spawn area right now, and as you can see, it says Winterfest 2023 begins in six days. Doesn't say how many hours and minutes for some reason, but we know it's in six days, so that means in next week's update, the Winterfest is coming, so stay tuned for that. That's gonna be really exciting. But let's go ahead, walk in the dealership, and check out all the new cars. All right, let's head into new vehicles. First off, we have the 2020 Trek Pro. We can go ahead and open it up. This is supposed to be a Jeep Grand Cherokee. The model's all right on it. Only thing I would change is you see the front end here. You see these weird lines. I would just remove those, but besides that, this thing looks pretty good. Top speed, 134 miles per hour. 0 to 60, 5.5 seconds. Handling 41%, $65,000 onto the next vehicle. This is supposed to be a Chevy Camaro. It actually doesn't look horrible. I would say this looks pretty good. This is one of the best fake models yet, to be honest. The side looks exactly like the real thing front end looks basically exactly like the real thing except for that weird hood scoop but like that that just looks like an aftermarket hood and then the rear end only difference looks like the tail lights so this is a really good fake model right here i like it top speed two up three miles per hour zero to 60 3.7 seconds handling 57 percent seventy thousand dollars super cool looking car let's go ahead and see what the final vehicle is okay so what is this I have no clue what this thing is, so it might be that new, um, god, what's that car called, um, let me go ahead and find it on Google real quick, I'll show you guys. Alright, so the car looks kind of like two cars mixed together, it looks like the mix of a Bugatti Bolid, because of like the spec and also some of the design aspects, and then the shape looks like it was inspired by this car, the Zenvo Aurora, um, so yeah, if we actually go ahead back over to Roblox, you can see what I'm saying, like the shape looks like the Zenvo. But the color scheme and some design elements, such as the rims, the taillights, sort of, um, the headlights, just and also the windshield, some of the design elements kind of look like the Bugatti Bolide, so I would say it's like a mix. This thing has a top speed of 310 miles per hour, 0 to 60, 2.2 seconds, handling a 59%, 10 million. Wow, that's expensive. But yeah, let's go ahead, test out this car. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and do that right now. All right, so I've just got confirmation that this is in fact the Bugatti Bolide and not the Zenvo Aurora. So if we look, it's called a Navarro, and this car right here, um, hang on, let me spawn it. This is also called a Navarro, and this is supposed to be an old Bugatti, therefore making this a Bugatti as well. Let's go ahead and spec this and test it out. All right, I've just maxed this thing out. Check it out. We're going so fast. 388 without boost, and oh my god, wait, oh, oh, shoot, oh, shoot, um... All right, I've just maxed this thing out, and oh my god, is it crazy. We're going 388 without boost, and with boost, we're going 300, or 416. Oh my god, that's fast. Dang. By the way, with the spec I want on it, it's similar to the stock one, but I've just changed up the blue slightly and added metallic wrap. This thing's a beauty, man. Oh, I've just crashed it, but I, I know it's a fake model, but it, it looks pretty cool, I'm gonna be honest. The front end is a bit weird, but the rest, I mean, it looks pretty unique. I like the design personally. Let me know what you think of it in the comments. I don't think it looks horrible though. Um, but yeah, now I'm gonna go ahead and see how it does on the circuit. All right, we are on the circuit race. I'm expecting this thing to do one of the best times I've ever done. So cue a time lapse so I can focus. Bro, oh my god, we were doing so good and then we just screwed up right there. I'm gonna have to do a really good second lap. Yo, I just set a new personal best. Let's go, two minutes and 58 seconds. I'm not the best racer ever. But I set a new personal best, man, in this car, bro. This thing is great for the track. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and take out that Camaro and make a pretty cool spec on it, because that car looks sick. All right, guys, I've gone ahead and specced and maxed out the new Camaro. I'm gonna take it on the drag race first, but then after that, we're gonna take the Bugatti on the drag race. Now, I already set a new personal best with the Bugatti. Unfortunately, my recording stopped, so we gotta re-record it, but you guys will see how crazy the Bugatti is in one second, but first, let me go ahead and show off this Camaro real quick. 
Come on, bro. I hate how long these races take to get started. They have the whole little cut scene. Then we have to wait for this countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Let's see. How fast is it going to go? I'm going to say maybe like a mm, couple seconds. I don't know, like seven, six, 6.2 seconds. Not bad considering, you know, it wasn't even that expensive for this car. And now it's time to use the Bugatti. You guys probably already saw the score, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna just show you guys anyways how it performs. All right, guys, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, Bugatti. How fast are you gonna go? All right, we're going 170, 100, 200, 260, 270, 300. 4.6 seconds. That is fast. Wow. This thing is probably the new best performing car for like all around performance. It can do every type of race and it can do it well. So if you have the money, I would definitely say get this car, you know. It might be a fake model, but that doesn't change the fact that it's probably the best performing one in the game. So yeah, definitely go ahead and get this car. Well, that's gonna be everything for today's video. Drop a like if you enjoyed, I would truly appreciate it. Subscribe, ring that notification bell so you never miss another upload, and I will see you on the next one. Peace.